Oh, don't you remember sweet Betsy from Pike, who crossed the wide prairie with her lover Ike, with two yoke of oxen and a big yeller dog? Tall Shanghai rooster in one spotted hog. One evening quite early they camped on the plat. Twas near by the road on a green shady flat, where Betsy sore footed lay down to repose. With wonder I gazed on that Pike County road. Shanghai ran off, and their cattle all died. That morning the last piece of bacon was fried. Poor Ike was discouraged, and Betsy got mad. Dog drooped his tail and looked wondrously sad. Sweet Betsy from Pike. They soon reached the desert where Betsy gave out, and down in the sand she lay rolling about, while I, half distracted, looked up with surprise, saying, "Betsy, get up! You'll get sand in your eyes." Sweet Betsy got up. In a great deal of pain, declared she'd go back to Pike County again. But I gave a sigh, and they fondly embraced, and they traveled along with his arm round her waist. Well, out on the prairie, one bright starry night, they broke out the whiskey, and Betsy got tight. She sang and she shouted and danced o'er the plain. And made a great show for the whole wagon train. Oh, sweet Betsy from Pike. Mmm, sweet Betsy from Pike. They swam the wide rivers and crossed the tall peaks and camped on the prairie for weeks upon weeks. Starvation and cholera, hard work and slaughter. They reached California and spied hell in high water. Long Ike and Sweet Betsy attended a dance where Ike wore a pair of his Pike County pants. Sweet Betsy was covered with ribbons and rings. Said Ike, you're an angel, but where are your wings? Well, Ike and Sweet Betsy got married, of course, but Ike, getting jealous, obtained a divorce, and Betsy, well satisfied, said with a shout, "Goodbye, you old lummox. I'm glad you backed out."